Hi guys, and I am back with this um, request review by um, Northern Soul Express. Um, as always, his channel will be down in the description. It's a great channel. Um, he has a floor um, layout, which has got some pretty nice stuff on. He also um, has clips on there of real steam engines, you know. Um, so yeah, please don't take his channel out if you feel the need to. Um, but down below anyway. So anyway, yeah, he asked me to review the um, Somerset and Dorset Joint Railway 7F. Um, I already thought I reviewed this, but I haven't. Um, so here we go, here's his review. Um, it is a Backman one. Um, I believe it's the newer one. I do have the box, but I had a few comments about um, unboxing taking too long, so I'm trying to skip that. Um, so yeah. Before we start, I'll just warn you, it is one of them that's joined, as you can see there. Um, so, yeah. Um, this one is number 53806 and it is custom weathered. Um, a mate did it for me. We'll look at it in more detail. So, the local has, as you can see, you can see it, Sprung buffers, um, it has a nice um, separately applied details, pipe work, uh, handrails, um, as you can see there, um, lamp irons, uh, chain link coupling, and smoke block dart, and um, uh, number board on the um, door, smoke block door. Um, it has rivets on the cab. De the cab. It has safety valve and whistle separately applied. Um, separate handrail around the um, outside of the cab. Um, same on the tender. It's all separately applied. Um, steps, handrails, all, all there. And as you can see, this one's been obviously customised. It's got the water image um, there in the tender of spilt water, and it has um, coal. Um, the cab detail, yeah, it's got loads of cab detail. Um, it's got a wood flooring. Um, there's the cab detail. Everything's um, that's a pretty nice one actually. Um, I'm trying the best with the light. Let's see if we can get a better one for you. Um, this might be better. Um, yeah. So yeah, we've got everything there. Uh, Batman has done a really nice job on that. Um, as we're here, I'll just show the linkage. As you can see, linkage is pretty good too. So yeah, that's that's what um, Northern Soul asked me to review for him, and I have. Um, please check out his channel. Um, obviously, following this, there is going to be a running session. The S and D J R. Class 7F, a 280 locom locomotive. Uh, the Somerset and Dorset Joint Railway 7F, 280, is a class of steam designed to haul heavy coal trains and goods trains. Um, 11 of them were built in two batches in 1914 and 1924. And they were used. Um, they were used until they were drawn in 1959 and 64. Two are preserved. Here is some information on the class that I just looked at. Um, power type is steam. Designer is Henry Fowler. Uh, builders are Midland Railway, Derby Works in 1914, and Robertson, um, Robert and Stevenson and Co. in 1925. Uh, the built dates are. 1914 was 6 and 1925 was 5 and there was 11 produced as we know. The wheel configuration is a 280. Cylinders 2 outside, uh, fuel coal. Valve type, Wilshire, brake, uh, loco brake, steam, uh, train, vac uh, train brakes, vacuum. I operated under the Somerset and Dorset Railway, the London, Midlands, Scotland and the British Railway. The power classification under the Somerset and Dorset Railway, 5P and 5G. Under the LMS it was a 7F. 
Uh, they were drawn in between 1959 and 64, and two were preserved and nine were scrapped. Here is some information on the loco I just looked at. Um, the number is 53806. Uh, the LMS uh, number is 13806. Uh, the pre grouping number, the first pre grouping number, uh, SDJR 86. Class, co uh, class code was a SDJ7F. Designer was Fowler. The wheel configuration is the 280. It was built on the 31st of the 7th, 1925, um, at Robert and Stevenson and Co. Company. Um, the 1948 shed code and the last shed code is 71G Bath Green Park. It was drawn on the 31st of the 1st, 1964, at Cashmore, uh, Newport. Um, and it was disposed on the 31st of the 7th, 1964. So yeah guys, that's it on the tracks. Um, looks pretty nice, you get a better view of the weathering um, and, and this light. So we're going to try on some of these Hornby killer points. Um, just move the dial. So yeah guys, um, that's my review of the uh, 7F Somerset Dorset, um, it's a nice loco overall, um, I like freight loco so it's a must for me and um, Batman has done a really nice job. Um, please check out um, Northern Soul Express's channel which is down below, so will my Twitter link because I can't remember it will be down below as well. Um, yeah, and I hope you enjoy the bonus footage that is to follow. So yeah guys, thank you for watching and God bless. Goodbye.